So this earthworks here, when you stop and look at it on the monitor, this is the plan view. But it shows you the excavator. So this is the garage over here, and this is the house. This is the front porch, and then this is the back deck. So when you look at it here, here's your driveway coming into the garage below, here's your driveway coming in the garage up above. Parking area, front walkway to the front porch. When you look at it here, just make it bigger, drag it over, make it bigger. So you can see exactly where you are at at all times on the monitor. So this over here is off design. So if I come over into here, it's going to give me a thing that says off design. So if I come back over here, the little red dot, if you look at the red dot, that's the bucket focus. So see right here, there's your bucket focus there. So that's what that red dot is right there. So my bucket is hovering right over the top of that corner. That's a deck footing there. There's another deck footing over here. And then the deck goes across here. So there's another footing here and another footing here. So I gotta dig out these two footings. And then I gotta dig out. I'm digging out this footing. This is the back of the house. It's a walk out here. And it goes back this way, it goes across. And then there's the other corner, it goes back up this way. And it has a little jock there. And then if you look at it here, this is the garage, so garage and house. And this wall right here, there's actually a two foot step down to the lower garage from the basement. So as I pan over here and look, so those stakes over there, so there's a garage over there, and then there's another one over here we knocked down with the loader, but that one right there is the edge of the garage. So the stakes are all in here, but they're also in here too. So as you can see, I've got my trench for my footing right there, and then my wall, and then my, that's, this is all for my, this right here is for a wall, and then the back footing comes here and then goes across right here, and then it actually turns and goes in this way, and then it turns and goes that way, but there's a spot footing that's right here for the deck. And if you look at where I'm at here, that's what I just showed you is this wall here and then this spot footing here, or this spot footing right here, and then the wall turns and goes in this way, goes across. So you can make this thing, you can bring it right in and see exactly where you're at, or you can go back, or you can swipe two fingers across this way. You have two different views. You swipe another one. You can change it all up however you want. So pretty crazy what you can do with this system go back to plan view but or you can hold this and you can change your different views so let's just say I wanted to, whoops let's just say I wanted to go three-dimensional so I go done now that shows me where I'm at with the plan so just kind of drag it around. You can see where things are at and elevations are at. So these are rock walls here. This is finished floor. Then I just cut down 15 feet to get to the bottom of my frost footing. Or I just, if I just tap this right here, it goes back to 12. So that puts me back at basement grade, which is right out in there. And then, so that's basement grade, which is at the negative 12. And then this is bottom of footing grade for the, for the frost coverage, which is right here. I just toggle this. Come back up to 15. So there's lots of different things that you can do with this system. You can see the driveway coming up here and it goes in underneath the bottom garage up here at the top top garage and that purple right there so you can see that's a garage floor then you step up two feet for the main floor so lots of lots of really cool stuff that you can do with this system